Oh my god, it's our chance. I'm so gonna miss this though. gentlemen what is going on fly here welcome back to the channel today we have a little small challenge that i've only seen been complete i've never been able to do it do it myself maybe that's because i was in the right situation i wasn't focusing on that but it should be doable this is kyle benjamin he says hey fly get a kill with a smoke shell attempt number five now you would think that a smoke shell would be, well, for smoking things up, not for an aggressive tactic. But there is explosive mass in the shell and kinetic energy, or at least just, it, it goes, right? So it's fired from the cannon, and when it impacts, well, the energy's gotta go somewhere. And the energy has to go into the thing that you impact. So you have that kinetic energy and you have the explosive mass. Now, it's not like an APHE explosive mass, if you will but it explodes and sends the smoke out. See, this isn't like a smoke grenade that you pull the pin and it kind of goes shh. This, when it impacts, it will cover eight to 13 meters spread right then and there. Well, let's get a little bit closer for a better demonstration, but as you see right there, let's do up close and personal. Boom, the smoke gets pushed out. So just, Imagine a M13 or M16 or, well, actually, we can't do that. A Gepard, because we are the Germans, or a Soki, or just a open top anti air. That's what we're going to be going after today. Now, just looking at the shell, it's 6.8 kilograms. There we go. 50 grams of explosive mass. And as we take a look at our APHE, we have 80 grams of explosive mass. So maybe it does work the same way as an APHE but it can't penetrate. As you can see, it has, there's not even any penetrating data on it. But if we shoot it into the open top portion of a vehicle, the explosive mass on paper or on stat card should work the same as if this was an APHE with 50 grams. Shrapnel energy will go somewhere and hopefully killing the enemy vehicle's crew. So without further ado, Kyle, thanks for the suggestion for this challenge. Hope your kid did well in football, whatever, how many years ago that was. I bet he did great. Comments below, guys. Let me know what you want to try or what you want me to try out next. That isn't the norm in War Thunder. All right, let's get started. So battle rating 1.3. We're going to be using the AP. Oh, hi, Baba. Hello. Uh, we're going to be using the APH here, the APCBC, excuse me, the one with a explosive filler. Just because at battle rating 1.3, we're going to face a lot of squishy targets. But at range, it does die off. But I'll tell you right now, I probably won't be able to hit something at 1,000 meters with this shell. We're going to take 23 of those and maybe 20 heats. And then the rest just loaded up with uh, the smoke shell. This should be good. And the nice thing about the Panzer IV C, and the reason why I chose to use this vehicle today, is because it has a pretty darn, I see that tank in front of me, a pretty darn big shell, 75 millimeters, and it's at low battle rate, and a quick reload, and good top speed. Let's see what's in front of us over here. We got Hago, I think he might have taken somebody out. We're gonna have smoke shell on the second shell of today. Hey, okay, pushing right through this. Oh, boys, the Blitzkrieg is among us. We're going to take a left in the cover up here and uh, hopefully be cheeky breaky for a little bit. Oh, okay, I got one enemy tank. I don't know, like, should I be able to, you know, we're going to try it. We're going to load. Uh, the smoke shell for this T20 or T26. I want to try to go right for its turret neck. It's not going to work out. That guy was like, holy shit, I fucking bounced something. Okay, one more over here. Come on, let's rotate or traverse. Put him in sight.
That should be it, unless there's one just... Okay, I saw a muzzle flash over here, or muzzle debris. I saw it. Whoa. No, it's a fucking house. Okay, I think we're cleared. <gasps> oh god, that thing's fucking scary. What's up, friends? We are in the thick of it right now. Okay, his cannon breach is dead. He won't be shooting at us. Hopefully an anti-air will push over here. And I don't think he has any fire extinguishers. That thing is a fucking barbecue right now. No fucking way. Okay, finally he's dead. Ooh, a M13. Ooh, a T26E as well right here. I think that's him. Look at this depression we have. Dude, this tank is really good for battle rating 1.3. Smoke shell load! Smoke shell load! Smoke shell load! Oh, it does do stuff! Okay, we're almost there. This guy could kill us from the side. But the down part is, is that once we fire, uh, they're kind of stuck in the uh, the smoke. At least this guy chose to be. I don't know where he went. Where did he, oh wait, no, no, no. Okay, he's another one maybe? Or maybe he did a full 360? He should be pushing up. No, 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 no. Keep it three. Oh, if these guys flank me. This is gonna feel bad. Uh, I have no idea where that M13 went, boys. No idea. But there's one over here. The game's pretty much over. We're gonna risk it. If he gets our side, we're dead. Tank to our right. Oh no, it was a gauze. That would have been perfect. Okay, this is actually M13 right here. Why are these anti-air so fucking sneaky? Got him in sight. Did nothing. This is going to be fucking challenging. <laughs> Oh, crap. He's on the move. We got to get, like, kind of above him so we can fire into it. This guy's panicking because he thinks I can... Oh, right there, right there, right there. Don't let him... Don't let him get your side. Don't let him get your side. Another hit. This guy's like, holy shit, he sucks. He can't even kill me. Oh, shit, he's actually in that smoke. He doesn't see me, though. Maybe we, maybe we might set off his ammo? We need to get above him. There's above him, right? What the fuck is this? There we go! Is he still there? Oh, no! He's going for the flank! No! Got his fuel tank! 24 shells to go! What the fuck? We still got him in sight here. We'll get it RNG time. Ah! No, 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 no. Okay, we're trying to flank around. Oh, there he is. Oh, shit.
Oh my gosh. No. 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 Is it round two again? We need a one shot here. Bruh. <gasps> There's his fucking head. Nah, dude. Nah. This is good. This is really, really good. Reversing the Russians, which I don't say too often. Oh shit, it's going down. But the good thing is they're capturing A. Oh no, don't shoot me yet. Okay, that's from the, the other side. We're gonna have to snipe with this smoke shell. But the reason why it's good to verse Russia is because they have those open top vehicles that is getting really close to my left side. If this enters that vehicle from the front. Oh sh Oh wait, wait, we can do this guy too, right? Oh god, they're 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 doing speedy things. Okay, let's just stay hidden. We don't want to show our cupola. There goes a god damn dude. Uh, low tier so fucking fun. Let's call this guy out to our team. Attention to the map. Okay, we can potentially get two here. Is that the right round? Yes, it was. Okay, there's smoke. It was smoke. Okay. All right, good. Chill, chill. I was like, there's no way that worked that fucking well right there. Okay, one down early game. Now we got that anti-air to worry about. Did you guys get that BT-5 behind me? Hopefully you guys did. Check our front. That anti-air is opening up right now, too. I can hear him. Okay, did he move? He definitely did move, which is unfortunate. How much did he move, though, by? Okay, LVT just killed him, unfortunately. Well, that's one way to tell an enemy that you're here. Back in the cover, pull back in the cover. Okay, we're gonna move into a better position. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh shit, that guy's far away. He is, he, he is not happy. What's his distance? I'm gonna go with 800. I'm gonna go just short of 800. Ooh. Oh, wow. All right. Tango down. Now, they are capturing C. Who would capture C, though? Like, like, I didn't see anyone push up on the left side. BT5, M2A2 just killed him. I'm really looking forward to that anti-air suit enemy team pushing to C right now. Oh shit, big tree in front of me. God damn it. Tango right. Boo, bitch. We got a friendly plane shooting at a building in the sea capture point. We're gonna rush in there, I guess. Oh, we got some smoke kicking up too. There's no one in here either, which is even more sketchy. He left. We're gonna push up the left side, have our AP C B C round loaded up, and quickly get rid of it if we see an enemy tank or an enemy anti-air that we could, or just a, a tank in general that we could go through or kill. Come on, just one anti-air. Just fun and it won't hurt you. I mean, it really, I mean, you might die, but it, it won't hurt. It's one little spawning. 
We'll even give you a little fanfare before you go with a fucking smoke round! Because right now, Ildar is gonna get into their spawn and just camp. Oh! Why did I just stay there for a little bit longer? I was right here. I would have maybe seen him. If he would have shot me, I would have died. His round is about as strong as mine, at least in explosiveness. But he might want revenge on me and he might come back here. That was spooky as fuck. Yo, yeah, he's back, he's back. He has to be an anti-air calling artillery like that, right? If the artillery kills me, I'm gonna be mad. Oh, the M2A4 is... Maybe that, those are his 50 cows? Come on, we have our heat, or our smoke shell loaded. Okay, where, what's happening? How did I just get artillery called on me if... I heard something get impacted up here, but no call out or no Chevron or anything. <gasps> oh my God, is there a chance? I'm so gonna miss this though. <laughs> His gunner disintegrated. I mean, disintegrated. 75 millimeter smoke shell to his fucking asshole. God bless. Oh. Oh, that was too good. That that's a surprise smoke butt sex. That was great. That was that was stupendous. I love doing things like that in War Thunder. Using. A, a round that's not supposed to be really for killing tanks or killing enemy players. It's more supposed to, it's more supposed to be used as, def as a defensive measure. But guys, I hope you have enjoyed this video today. I gotta start playing more of the uh, Panzer 4C battle rating 1.3. This thing's ridiculous. Like everything you look at, you're gonna one shot. And it was. It almost makes it seem like the game's trying to pull you in, you know? Like, oh man, I'm fucking good at this game. I need to play more. Buy Golden Eagles. But seriously, guys, hope you have enjoyed. Until next time, peace the flip out.